In this video, we're going to explore 20 valuable tips and hidden features that can enhance your Windows 11 experience. These tips cover a wide range of functionalities, from keyboard shortcuts to personalization options, and they can significantly improve your efficiency and ease of use with the operating system. Number 1. New Shortcut Keys Windows 11 introduces new shortcut combinations involving the Windows logo key. When you press the Windows logo key along with the W key, denoted as W for widget, it triggers the new widget's pane. On the left-hand side, you can also utilize the Windows logo key in A key, representing A for action. In Windows 10, this used to open the action center, but now it activates quick settings, allowing you to adjust monitor brightness and volume levels. Similarly, using the Windows logo key in conjunction with the in key, symbolizing in for notifications, brings up the notification pane in your calendar. Lastly, the combination of the Windows logo key and the Z key, indicated as Z for Zulu, opens snap layouts, enabling you to easily arrange your open windows on the screen. Alternatively, you can hover over the Maximize button to access Snap Layouts. These shortcut keys offer a more convenient and time-saving way to perform these actions. Number 2. Add More Themes While it initially offers a handful of attractive pre-installed themes, you have the option to enhance your personalization choices. Just navigate to Settings, go to Personalization, choose Themes, and then click on Browse Themes. This will open up a treasure trove of hundreds of unique themes for you to explore and install, allowing you to fully customize your Windows experience according to your preferences. Number 3. Shortcut to Task Manager Let's talk about the Task Manager, our go-to destination for closing apps that aren't quite cooperative. To access the Task Manager conveniently, you can use a nifty shortcut key. Simply press Ctrl, Shift, and Escape simultaneously. This streamlined approach eliminates the need to go through the old control alt alternate delete process followed by selecting Task Manager, which often involves more steps and clicks. Number 4. Night Light You can activate warmer color tones as the evening progresses, making it easier on the eyes and aiding in better sleep. To enable this feature, right-click on your desktop and choose Display Settings. Within Display Settings, you can toggle the night light on or off, and even configure a schedule for its activation and deactivation based on your preferences. Number 5. Make Mouse Cursor More Visible You can enhance the visibility of your mouse cursor, making it more user-friendly for your audience. In the Settings menu, navigate to Accessibility and then access the Mouse Pointer options. Here, you have the flexibility to modify the mouse pointer's size and even tweak its color which can be particularly useful when using applications like Microsoft Teams, Zoom, or recording your screen. Notably, this capability wasn't available in Windows 10. Number 6. Hide Desktop Icons During presentations when your desktop is on display, you can conveniently conceal all your desktop icons, avoiding any impression of clutter. To do this, right-click on your desktop, navigate to the View option, and simply toggle off the Show Desktop Icons feature. Voila, a clean and tidy desktop at your service. Number 7. Redesigned Emoji Picker By simultaneously pressing the Windows logo key and the semicolon key, you'll open the revamped Emoji Picker in Windows 11. This tool not only lets you select emojis but also offers options for choosing GIFs, Kimojis, and even symbols. Number 8. Copy and Paste Multiple Items most of us are familiar with the standard copy and paste shortcuts, Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus V. However, an interesting twist is the ability to copy and paste multiple items. The process remains the same for copying, using Ctrl plus C as usual. But when it comes to pasting, instead of hitting Ctrl plus V, you can leverage the Windows logo key in combination with the V key. This action opens a menu where you can select from the various items you've copied to your clipboard, giving you the freedom to choose which one to paste. Number 9. Start Menu Navigation Within the Start menu, specifically when you access All Apps, you're met with an extensive list of all installed applications. What makes this process more efficient is the ability to click on the various headers, enabling quick navigation through the alphabet. For instance, if you are searching for the snipping tool, you can simply click on S, and swiftly locate all the applications that begin with the letter S on your computer. 
Number 10. Snipping Tool. Windows 11 boasts an impressive screenshot tool known as Snipping Tool. To activate it, you can perform a search for Snipping Tool and capture screenshots of your desired screen area. However, there's a more convenient method. In the Settings menu, navigate to Accessibility, then click on Keyboard. Here, you have the option to enable a nifty feature. By doing so, you can configure the Print Screen button on your keyboard, which traditionally captures the entire desktop, to launch the Snipping Tool app instead. This simplifies the tool's accessibility. Number 11. Add additional clocks. You have the option to incorporate extra clocks into your Windows setup. This is particularly useful if you need to keep track of time zones for friends or family living in different regions. You can conveniently add another clock in the lower right-hand corner of your screen. Begin by right-clicking on the time, select Adjust Date and Time on the subsequent screen, and then click on Date and Time once more. At the bottom of this menu, you'll find the Add Additional Clocks option, allowing you to include two additional clocks and have a total of three distinct time zones visible. Number 12. Dark Theme. You have the option to enable the dark theme in Windows. To do this, navigate to Settings, choose Personalization, and then access the Colors section. Within these settings, you can activate the dark theme not only for Windows itself but also for various applications. What's particularly handy is that many apps will automatically adopt this setting. So whether you're using Microsoft Office or a web browser, they will transition to dark mode, providing much needed relief for your eyes. Number 13. Startup Apps. You have the ability to manage the applications that launch when your computer starts up. If you've noticed a sluggish startup, it might be due to numerous apps trying to initiate. To take control of this, go to Settings and select Apps on the left-hand side. Scroll to the very bottom within the Apps section and click on Start Up. There, you'll find a list of apps that currently launch with your computer. You can easily enable or disable them as per your preference. Number 14. Sticky Notes. You have the capability to generate sticky notes on your Windows system by using the search function. Just search for sticky notes and you can affix digital notes directly onto your screen. What's particularly impressive is that these notes are synchronized in the cloud, making them accessible on your iPhone or Android device through the OneNote app. You can also access them via the OneNote website on the web. In essence, your notes are seamlessly synced across various platforms, ensuring accessibility from everywhere. Number 15. Voice Dictation You have the ability to verbally communicate with your computer, and it will transcribe your speech accurately. Just press the Windows logo key along with the H key, signifying H as in Hotel on Windows 11. An added advantage is the new feature that automatically inserts punctuation for a smoother dictation experience. Number 16. Video Editor. Windows houses a video editing tool discreetly nestled within the Photos app. To access it, initiate a search for Video Editor, and you can commence a new project. This allows you to import video files, arrange them in your storyboard, and begin crafting your video. It's suitable for basic video editing needs, but if you're seeking a more advanced video editing tool, this may not be the ideal choice. While it doesn't support transitions and has certain limitations, it's a decent option for casual video editing. Number 17. Screen Record with Game Bar. You have the option to capture your screen using a built-in Windows 11 application, known as the Xbox Game Bar. You can initiate it by pressing the Windows logo key along with the G key, with G standing for Game. This tool allows you to record a variety of content, whether it's a gameplay session or a PowerPoint presentation. It serves as a reliable screen recorder, though it's worth noting that it cannot record your desktop or file explorer activities. Apart from that limitation, it covers a wide range of recording options. Number 18. Quick Assist. We have the Quick Assist tool, which comes in handy when assisting friends or family with computer issues. We all know that guiding them over the phone can be quite frustrating. Quick Assist offers a more efficient alternative. You can generate a unique code, share it with the person in need, and gain access to their computer, allowing you to take control and see exactly what they're experiencing. This method proves far more effective than trying to verbally explain complex computer problem-solving steps. Number 19. Personalized Desktop. 
Another feature to explore is the ability to personalize your lock screen experience. On your desktop, simply right-click and choose Personalize. Within this menu, click on the Lock Screen option. From here, you have the freedom to select a static picture, run a slideshow, or opt for the dynamic Windows Spotlight option, which offers daily refreshing images. You can also include additional information on your lock screen, such as the weather, email updates, or upcoming calendar appointments. In my case, I've chosen the calendar. Number 20. Pin Websites to Taskbar. As we all spend a significant portion of our time on our PCs browsing the web, wouldn't it be convenient to launch websites directly from the Windows taskbar? Here, I'm using Google Chrome and visiting my favorite site, edarabia.com. If you'd like to pin a website to your taskbar, you can follow along. Start by clicking on the ellipsis in the top right corner, then navigate to More Tools. From there, you can create a shortcut. Once you've done that and clicked OK, you'll have a shortcut on your desktop. While that's handy, you might prefer to have it on your taskbar. To do this, right-click the desktop shortcut, head to More Options, and there, you'll find the option to pin it to your taskbar. Click on it, and you'll now have quick access to your chosen website with just one click from your taskbar. From uncovering hidden Windows 11 gems to streamlining your computer experience, these tips are your go-to guide. With these tricks at your disposal, you'll be able to navigate the Windows 11 landscape more efficiently and make the most out of your computing adventures. Happy exploring!